Because this is a relatively rare event, and the entire event was visible from the Northeast, what we did was to set up telescopes, both on campus at MIT, and we also had the telescopes at the Wallace Astrophysical Observatory. What we did here on campus is we had a couple of telescopes set up in McDermott Court. We had a bunch of students from EAPS and physics coming by and helping out with the telescopes and helping people. They were also helping taking pictures. Um, we had one telescope equipped with a camera. Two of them were set up to capture the sun and Mercury in just white light. In that configuration, what you see is Mercury as a small, sharp black dot crossing over the sun. And you also get to see sunspots in their glorious, you know. We also had one telescope that had an H-alpha filter, so it's in a deep red wavelength. And in that telescope, you can also see prominences along the limb of the sun, which are just small explosions on the surface of the sun, and it just is sending material out into space. You know, when these things happen, it's nice to just go and view them, even if it's not you know, relevant for the science that I do. Lots of people have interest in these kinds of things. And so I run a monthly open observing session here. It's something that we're gonna do anyway because we're interested and we wanna see it. And so why not put in a little extra effort and make it available to everybody at MIT and also anywhere on the web. So that's what we did. Yeah.